The State of the Union Address is an opportunity for the President to speak to the nation and to Congress about our country's most pressing priorities. Tonight, President Obama used the primetime moment to set forth a big government agenda, not bipartisan solutions. After five years of the Obama administration, Americans are tired of waiting for recovery. The economy is still weak. It's dragged down by anemic growth and high unemployment. A fundamentally flawed health care law has forced families across the country to deal with canceled insurance policies, higher premiums, and fewer choices. At a time for leadership and cooperation, the president continues to threaten unilateral executive action instead of offering to work with Republicans and Democrats. The president continues to advocate the politics of jealousy rather than promoting a message that would inspire economic growth. Republicans have a number of ideas to reignite the economy and put Americans back to work. Empowering the private sector to create jobs, achieving a real market-based health care reform, and tapping into America's rich energy potential are a few ways to start. The best welfare program is a jobs program. The best unemployment program is one that stimulates job growth. Both political parties have an interest in creating jobs and more opportunities for the American people. The president should meet Republicans in the middle to achieve these goals.